Today is the day we hop across the pond. What's up guys, it's Rettles back with more predictions. RLCS 11, no, RLCS 21-22, Spring Split, Regional 1, European Edition. We just had our regional, took second place, G2 first. Now we're across the pond the weekend following for Europe. Preface this with, I really don't watch European close calls as much as I should. I do not watch European trench teams as much as I should. I had to look up who was on Wild. I had to look up who was on Wolves. I didn't have to look up who was on SA because they did good in the Dacia tournament. I had to look up who was on BS+. Plus. Freaky. Tadpool. No, Tadpool. A Acro. Okay. Okay. Acro flip reset on me twice last night and ranked. So he might have the thumbs up towards his endpoint matchup. However, let's get into it. Um, well, first rounds are always rapid fires. First round and lower round one, pretty rapid fire. Don't talk much about them because most of them are self-explanatory like that one. Rio. Ooh. This one's not self-explanatory. Uh, I like Carmine here. 3 2. Dignitas. I got you guys 3 1. Even though Sut is a great team endpoint, I got you guys 3 1. EG. This is my only upset of the first round. Oh, no, it's not. I have Vitality as well. I have BDS here. And I have Luminosity here. Okay. Lower. Oh, uh, go back. Rapid Fire again. Lowers. Who cares about lowers? BS. Plus, I'm sorry, Freaky. You're out of here, Sut. Welcome to round two. Oh, this makes for an interesting lower round one. Mm, EG, welcome Misfits. I'm sorry, this is not your split to choke. Oh, Tadpool versus Fruity. It is season four. I have the wolves. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go. Let's go back to uppers. Queso, okay, Carmine. Could be a good matchup. Nolly looks pretty good on Carmine. However, I don't think it is enough for the second best team in the world. I'll have Queso in four. Dignitas endpoint. Again, an English matchup. Could be close. I don't think it will be. I think endpoint falters. I think Dig. They messed up in the major. I don't think they mess up here. <sighs> team Liquid, Team Vitality. The two teams face each other. I'm going to give this one to Vitality. I like Vitality making their first top six in a while. Uh, I'll give it 3-1. BDS Luminosity happens every tournament. It goes five a lot. This is where I give the slight edge to Luminosity. I think BDS needs a little bit more time. Regional 1 could be a little, some growing pains like G2 had. I have, why is BDS there? Okay. Yeah. Okay. I like that. BDS Semper. That could be tough, but... I think they have enough talent for that. The Semper, the French lineup, I think they'll need a little bit more time and maybe a little bit more talent to match this BDS team of it at four. Liquid Suh. I like Suh here. I'll put it in, yeah, five. Endpoint EG. I think endpoint, this is where you go home, sadly. Uh, Carmine Wolves. I will take Carmine here in that pool. Okay, this is where we start getting the spicy matchups. We have our top. Say eight of our top eight. Look at it, suh. Welcome to the top eight. Carmine, welcome to the top eight. Everyone else, you're used to this by now. <clears throat> We're gonna go to lowers. BDS, suh. BDS or suh. Top eight. Great performance for the first regional. This is where you end. EG Carmine. I'm gonna take. Ooh. So EG, the land team, versus Carmine, Astral, Nali Itachi. A ridiculous amount of natural talent on that team. Will it be enough for the EG team? Probably not. I'm going to give EG and five. Close one, though. Um, okay, back to uppers. We have upper semifinals. Queso Dig. A tail is all this time. I don't know how this match historically goes. 
I feel like the way Dig plays normally should be able to beat it. So I'm going to have Dig here in six. Vitality, Luminosity. This is a weird semifinal. And I'm going to give it to Luminosity. I think Luminosity will be in your European Regional 1 Upper Finals. Yep, I know guys, I know. Crucify me. Everyone's predictions are always wrong, so you might as well make them a little spicy. I'm gonna have them in five. Um, Queso BDS. Ooh, only one of these teams makes top four. Both locked top six right now. This could get questionable. Okay, let's look at it. <clears throat> you have Team Queso, who were in every grand final in the winter split. Regional major, didn't matter, grand final. You have BDS, who just picked up one of the best players in the world to duo with probably the best threes player in the world, at least in Europe. Three, best threes player in Europe. You can argue him my first kill. I don't really care. Ooh, best of seven. I think I'm going to give this one to the BDS. I think Queso, you're a great team. You've had your spotlight. Let someone else shine for once in seven. Close series and lowers. Vitality, EG. Okay. Vitality. Ah, this is. Hmm. I like Vitality here. I'm gonna give it to him in six. Re Ow. Reason being, Alpha 54 has shown us what he is capable of. RLCS X Championships. Dub. K. Dot Fairy. Not near their prime, near their peak. Alpha. It doesn't matter. Now, he has Mr. Radisson. Radisson. I repronounce it. Gross. Two mechanical young. I was not really young anymore, but he's got his duo that he's needed all this time. I think it's going to propel them into the top four. I like that. Yeah, okay, I like that. This bracket, guys, I know. I know. Predictions are hard. Whatever you disagree with, let me know in the comments. Whatever you agree with, let me know in the comments. Let's get up to our upper final. So this is all played on Championship Sunday. Welcome, BDS, Vitality, Dignitas, Luminosity to the top four. Okay. What are we feeling? Dig Luminosity, is this where Dig bounces back from the major? Tough performance from them, didn't even make championship, or no, they didn't even make Saturday. Got reverse swept twice, us and EG. Or do they continue to falter? I'm gonna have them bouncing back in six. Okay, we have BDS Vitality. I really like this Luminosity roster, if, if you guys haven't been able to. I think they just lose to BDS every time they play them. They play them like every time, so unfortunate for them. But BDS Vitality, I think BDS will make quick work of this Team Vitality roster. I think they just have too much talent. Quite the lower bracket run we've seen here from Team BDS, but I think they got it in them. Um, Luminosity, Team BDS in your lower finals. Hmm. Okay. These teams have played so much recently. I gave it to Luminosity in the uppers. I'm not going to give it to them in the lowers. I think BDS regains here and keeps their lower run going. Oh, that's not a four there. I want a two there. No, I want a one there, actually. I think BDS makes quick work of them as well. So in your regional one, European. Oh, oh go back. Wait. In your regional one, European, RLCS, grand final. You have Dignitas versus Team BDS, two teams who have looked to be Europeans best for a while now. Obviously, Queso's in there, number one seed last major, but BDS and Dignitas have been on top for quite some time now. Um, this is going to be a tough series. I will take Team BDS in the first series. I think it goes to seven, just like us versus G2 did. And your European Regional 1 winners going to be drum roll please bds i think they make again i think after that bracket reset they have all the momentum in the world they take down this scorching hot dignitas roster and that is what i believe happens again predictions are hard a lot of good teams any of these teams like there are probably six or seven no okay maybe not probably like five teams that could win this whole tournament it's impossible to predict who it is. However, these are my thoughts. If you guys like the prediction videos, let me know. Leave a like, subscribe, comment. If I'm right, 
I deserve a spot on the analyst desk, I think. But I will see you guys next time. Peace.